Good evening and welcome to Hungary Report. Start off public media and once foreign language news shows. I'm Cenge Gabriela Iboya with today's news from Hungary in the Carpathian Basin. Let's begin. We will protect utility cuts and take away extra profit, the Prime Minister announced in a video uploaded to his social media page. Viktor Orban said that as they had promised, families, the elderly, jobs and overhead cuts would be protected even in the protracted war situation. So the government would set up a utility cut defence and a national defence fund, which will be funded with special taxes on extra profits of large companies. Hungary and Serbia provide each other with secure transit routes for the transport of energy sources, the Minister of Foreign Affairs and Trade said. Peter Sierto met with the Serbian finance minister in Budapest, where he emphasized that Hungary has the largest natural gas storage capacity in Central Europe and gives Serbia the opportunity to use these domestic reservoirs. The head of the ministry stated, Hungary will not vote for Brussels' proposal on the oil embargo as long as it threatens Hungary's energy supply. Ukrainian President Vladimir Zelensky spoke at the Davos Forum via video chat, once again urging the introduction of the most painful sanctions against Russia. He again criticized Hungary for not supporting the EU oil embargo plan. Peter Sieto reacted to this on his social media page. In his post, he listed at length how much Hungary had to provide assistance to Ukraine and its refugees, and then concluded that Hungary would continue to help the war-torn country. One day after the ministers were sworn in, the state secretaries of Viktor Orbán's fifth government were also appointed. In the presence of the prime minister, President Katalin Novak handed over the deed of appointment of the new state secretaries at the Carmelite Monastery on Wednesday morning. And finally, monkeypox has appeared in Hungary. This is what Ferenc Jakob, a virologist, spoke about on Koshut Radio's programme this morning. According to the expert, there is no need to fear that the infection will cause a global pandemic like the coronavirus did, but the disease should not be taken lightly. And that's all for now, but don't forget, you can catch Hungary reports every night after 11 o'clock news and online as always. Do stick around and watch our German, Russian and Chinese language news. Thank you for watching and have a lovely evening.